CARES Pathways program seeks to improve the lives of rural women farmers in six countries across Africa and Asia. With support from the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, the initiative helps women increase their incomes, improve the health of their families, and empower their communities. In Malawi, Pathways builds on CARES work helping women establish their own savings associations and start small businesses. This has allowed them to increase their incomes, pay school fees for their children, and better respond to illness, death, or poor harvests. Pathways is designed to help women like Anastasia Saka take the next step, building on the improvements she's experienced as a member of a Village Savings and Loan Association, or VSLA. A VSLA consists of 15 to 30 people who meet each week to save money as a group. Every group receives intensive financial and literacy training to make sure they understand savings, interest, profit and loss, and financial bookkeeping. Members borrow money from the group to invest in small businesses or to pay household expenses. The loans are paid back with interest, which is shared among members. The results of few studies that have taken place um, show that more VSL women are able to negotiate with their husbands more now with regard to the decisions around health, around education, around uh, the crops that they need to grow, around the assets that they need to procure as a household. And this is a major issue that the women have been trying to push for, and VSL gives that platform for the women to push. VSL helps build that confidence. CARE, which pioneered the VSLA model 20 years ago, has now supported over 3 million women and men across Africa in taking the first step on the financial ladder through these savings groups that also spread on their own as participants train neighboring communities. The Pathways program is designed to build on this progress, helping VSLA members increase their ability to choose what they grow, where they sell, and how resources are spent. With an increasing number of smallholder women farmers now able to meet some basic needs, Pathways will help 150,000 farmers improve their access to high quality agricultural inputs, enhance their productivity, and expand their connections with growing markets. The result will be more empowered and prosperous farmers, healthier families, and more sustainable agricultural systems. CARE cannot do this alone. The Pathways program will partner with banks, input suppliers, traders, government officials, local power holders, communities and partners to promote the changes we seek. As Vikness Chimbanga explains, unity and relationships are key. <laughs>
Inayo cha kudia ni kudia panopa. Fete yase ni matengeli ndama kukwe kukukea kukusunga nukubereketa. Makopo ni wajaka kubwa ni makatapanda mazi jenu kakula fete yase ni magula ni matisha kushima. Kwa choke lako na ama indi inayo. For one to be productive, you need to have access to resources and abilities. And it's easier for men to have access to resources because that's how traditionally uh, it's been constructed, when actually it's women who do 70% of work in the field. And that disconnect is one of the major issues that are addressed with athletes, to make sure that women have access to the required information and access to the required financial resources so that they, they can make appropriate decisions on what to invest in, pushing those boundaries. With CARE support, Vicness, and Anastasia are moving toward a healthier and more prosperous future for their families. Through Pathways, CARE will help them and more than 100,000 others to take the next steps in their journey to secure their rights and free themselves from hunger and poverty. To learn more, visit www.carepathwaystoempowerment.org.